Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do a quick review of this 310 nutritional meal replacement shake that I ordered. It came in yesterday. I was super excited because I've been eyeballing it for a while and I kind of hemmed and hawed about it, um, did a ton of research, read a lot of reviews, um, and then I saw a discount code on Facebook. I want to eat like Todd Chrisley or someone had um, a discount code where you can get a starter pack for $9. So I figured for $9, I was going to give it a try. So the box came in, like I said yesterday, and unfortunately my husband put it out in the recycling bin. Um, but in the box was the shaker bottle and this cute little package. It's a mesh bag that has, I think there's, let me see, six, six different flavors of shakes in here. Um, so when you first open up the bag, I got a little excited, I'm going to say, at first, because on top was this little $100, it looked like a $100 gift card, um, so I was very excited about that, but then I pulled it out and put my glasses on and read the fine print. No, it's a chance to win a $100 gift card, um, and you have to like follow them on Instagram and post something about the shake and yada 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 so wah wah no hundred dollar gift card for me so we're just going to put that aside but that came in and the flavors that they sent me let me pull them out are strawberry let's see what else we got in here mocha vanilla chocolate, vanilla chai, which I have heard is really, really good, and my favorite, salted caramel. So the way these are supposed to work, um, it is supposed to be the cleanest meal replacement shake out on the market. Um, it's completely plant-based, so it is, it's a triplex protein blend. So it is made up of pea protein, rice protein, and hemp protein. Um, and each serving is only 90 calories. So one package is one serving and you're supposed to dump it into the shaker bottle and you can mix it, they say with either water or juice or um, unsweetened almond milk which is what I'm going to use. Um, it's supposed to have no cholesterol. Let me, let me see, let me put my glasses on. Get to the bottom of this. Okay, so it's sugar-free, dairy-free, soy-free, egg-free, nut-free, and gluten-free. And it's supposed to be vegetarian-friendly, and it's, uh, this is my little observation. It says it's also supposed to be on the package. It says it's vegan friendly. However, on the website, it says it's not vegan friendly because it contains dairy. So I don't know if they mean that it's, if you mix it with just water, does it then make it vegan friendly? I don't know. Um, so if you are a vegan, and are interested in trying the shakes, I would definitely look into that. Um, for me, it's, you know, it doesn't matter. I'm not vegetarian or vegan, but I know there are a lot of people that are. So uh, again, if you're interested in trying it and you do have a vegan diet, just double check to make sure that it is something that you can have. Um, but back to the serving size so one packet is one serving it is supposed to have 90 calories total fat is 1.5 grams um, it has no saturated or trans fat no cholesterol has 370 milligrams of sodium 30 milligrams of potassium 
it has seven grams of total carbs, five dietary um, fiber carbs. So um, I would I would think that the net I think the total net carbs is seven grams if I'm reading that correctly, and 15 grams of protein. So it's supposed to be really healthy. Um, like I said, it's, it's touted as one of the cleanest meal replacement shakes. And the way you're supposed to take it is you are to replace two meals per day with a shake and then have a sensible dinner. Um, so again, you can mix it with, it says water, juice, or almond milk, unsweetened almond milk. I'm sure you can use sweetened almond milk. You'd probably just have to calculate those calories into it. So I am going to try out this salted caramel and see how it goes. Now it's also supposed to give you tons and tons of energy. Um, so hopefully that's the case because my plan is to drink one each morning um, either before or on my way to physical therapy. Um, I do two hours of physical therapy three days a week. So usually halfway through I start to drag. So I'm hoping to drink this, like I said, either before or on my way to physical therapy. And hopefully it will give me enough energy to get through that. Um, but I am very excited. I made sure that we had some unsweetened almond milk in the fridge. So I am going to go wash this out. Oh, and as a side note, this is just something that always interests me, but the shaker bottle is BPA free, which is another good thing. So, so far I'm liking everything I hear. I'm liking everything that I'm reading. So I'm going to go rinse this out real quick and get the almond milk that I need to mix this up and we're gonna give it a whirl. Be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I have my 12 ounces of unsweetened almond milk and I'm going to try, oh, lost it, the salted caramel. So according to the directions, you just open this bad boy. Now one packet they say is one serving. Um, if you get like the big packages, um, then it's one scoop is a serving. But for these purposes, one pack. So you just dump it in there. It smells good. It smells like hot cocoa mix. And mix in. The almond milk. And then I guess it doesn't, it's not like a regular shaker bottle where it has like the ball at the bottom. It has this thing. I don't know what it's supposed to do, but it goes in like that. Okay, put the lid on. it's really on there because that would really stink if it went everywhere. Okay, so I'm going to hold it down and shake. It doesn't look like it's shaking very well. I see a, some of it, I don't know if you can see it, but it's some of it's like sticking to the side. I don't know if that's because I put the powder in first before the almond milk. I don't know. But I'm going to keep shaking it. A lot of jiggle going on. Sorry. It's still really chalky at the bottom. I don't know. I've seen in other reviews where people have put this in a blender and added some fruit, like 
strawberries and bananas. Um, I would think that the chocolate one with some banana mixed in probably tastes really good. Um, okay. I think, I think we're all, I'm shook. I think that's it. Give it another shake for good measure. Because I don't know about you guys, but I'm the kind of person that if I drink a shake like this and I get that like clumpy powder, like powdery mix, because it wasn't mixed well, I get turned off and I won't drink it. So let me make sure. But it looks like it's all mixed in. Give it a good look. It smells like caramel. Alright, here it goes. Ooh! Come on, 310! Y'all, this is good. The salted caramel, very good. Does not taste like a protein shake. Doesn't taste powdery. I'm trying to think of what it reminds me of. Um, almost like a praline. Um, you get that it, sweet caramel taste, but it's not too sweet. Um, yeah. Give it another little shake. I think I like it. Very yummy. Not chalky or powdery at all. Goes down really smooth. Kind of reminds me of like an iced coffee that you would get at Starbucks. Very nice. Um, I'm thinking this would probably be super good if you mixed it in a blender with some ice cubes to give it that like frappuccino texture probably be really really good that way but if you're in a hurry and you just have to get out the door it takes no time at all to mix it together I mean you saw it so it takes no time at all to get together and it's really good I'm gonna say I'm quite impressed I didn't expect it to be that good so I'm going to finish my shake and um, I don't know if I'm going to have another one later for lunch, but I will finish this one and let you know um, tomorrow. I'll do a follow-up film to let you know how it works. And hopefully in the process, I lose a few pounds because that can't hurt. That's always a good thing, right? But yeah, I will keep you tuned in. Um, if you are interested, in the 310 shake definitely go to their website the last time i checked which was a day i think it was two days ago i checked it um i think they they're running a special where you can get a starter pack which is the shaker bottle and six of these envelopes with different flavors of shakes and i think it's running for nine dollars which is a super deal i think by the time I got done paying like shipping and handling and tax and all that. It came out to just a little over $20. So it wasn't too bad. And it came really quick. I want to say it came within five days. So you don't really have to wait um, very long for it to arrive. But if you do try it, let me know. Or if you have tried it in the past, let me know in the comments below. I'd be interested to see if anyone else has tried it and what their results are but i will keep you informed with my progress and let you know how everything goes until next time i hope you all have an amazing day and i will see you in the next one bye guys